So what's a saying that you say often? Um, it's school appropriate. A lot of them are inappropriate for the camera. So a saying I say a lot is don't get it twisted because you shouldn't get it twisted. I'm out here getting that yiper, you know, that shmoney. Yeah, I'm Will Roach. It kind of helps me hype myself up for something. I'm sorry. I say it all the time when I screw up or do something stupid. I, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, yeah, all the time. I don't really got a catchphrase or anything. I'd say like the word what or uh, what. Those are words I use a lot in my daily life. I mean, I say I don't know a lot, cause like, I just really don't know what's going on half the time. Would you rather shoot spaghetti out of your fingers or sneeze meatballs for the rest of your life? Sneeze meatballs because I feel that's more nourishing than, than spaghetti. I could probably do more good with my gift. I think sneeze meatballs because I feel like meatballs are really good and you can always have more meatballs. Like I'd rather have meatballs than spaghetti and like if I want an extra meatball I can just sneeze out a meatball. The meatball's a no for me so. And also if you're blowing your nose like that just hurt. No. But with spaghetti you can not only surprise someone but you could also like shoot at the floor and maybe they'd slip on it. Cause like then you could just like come out of nowhere and just like slap somebody, but like with a little bit of extra room. <laughs> There's some spaghetti. Like, tell me you wouldn't be impressed by that. What's the most embarrassing thing that's ever happened to you at school? At school? Um, one time I was walking across the stage and I straight up just fell off the stage cause I was walking by the edge. When I was little, I was like eating ice cream and I spilled it on myself and then I had to walk around school with like ice cream all over my shirt and it just was not, not a good look for me, so. <laughs> like, there's obviously stuff that I've suppressed and I just can't remember. And, oh my gosh, literally, okay, so I had a friend and he had a guitar and he brought it into class and then I started playing the guitar, it's like in language arts, but then like I was really nervous because I never play in front of people, so it sounded really bad and it made me seem like a horrible guitar player. I'm not great, but I'm not bad, and it was literally the most embarrassing thing ever. It was like last semester, it's still like fresh in my mind, it's horrible. A kid uh, decided to scrape his na nails across my face in preschool, so to get back at him, I, um, he, he was allergic to eggs and I decided to put eggs in his breakfast. Uh, most embarrassing is probably uh, dancing in, uh, during lunch. Uh, I had a little dance off with another guy on a costume day and uh, I got in a little trouble with the uh, principals, but uh, you know, it was all in good fun and uh, I feel like I am better as a person because of it because now I'm free to dance whenever I want. I don't want to actually want this on record because people might steal it. <sighs> Can you understand this? What's going on? You're so distracted, you can't even understand it. I'm gonna have to borrow one from the uh, guy girl dance where it's a, uh, it's a nice, uh. All right, you can see me now. And then usually I can get back up. Yeah, that's my signature dance move. Everyone can do it. So yeah. So sad. Like. I would say my signature dance move is like twerking, but I'm not sure if I'm like allowed to do that in like a school thing, so <laughs> I'm gonna hold off on that one.